And before you probably saw me doing a lot of alternate picking exercises because that's what I was working on with the whole uh... <laughs> That whole thing, and then the... Alternate picking, but I pretty much just try to teach whatever I'm working on, so maybe it helps me get better at what I'm working on. And now I'm working on legato because I realized I completely suck at it because I stopped doing it for a while. So, I'm going to show you a pretty good exercise that I use to warm up for legato. Or, um... Just get maybe a little better at it. So I suck at pull off for some reason. I just forget how to do them, but I'm working on it. So it's pretty much just simple, or what you would call simple, like hammer on, just like with your first two fingers, and then your uh, these two fingers, and then these two fingers, and then uh, these two, and then these two, and then these two, and then eventually you get to these three, and then these three. And then all four. So first, I just start off. Just do that, and then switch fingers. Switch fingers. And then you go to. You start with this finger and then you do the two middle ones then you do these two then the hardest one the way hardest one okay so that's it for the doubles and what you might notice or I don't know if I did it or not but I try to do first I'll do it with my thumb in the back of the neck and then I'll switch and I'll do it so I'm kind of in more of like a rock a rock thing so I'll be like instead of that's also another good one though. so yeah I do them with both just so um depending on how you're going to be playing and whenever you're going to be learning or whenever you're doing the band practice or the solo um <clears throat> Also, you can try it on different strings, too. And, um, the threes. And you can switch the finger set. And then, um, you can try doing the same, but more spread out. And same thing, but just these three. So. And um, you do it all four. Yeah, and um, this is good warm up. I, I do it slower, just so. Do it slow just to help me warm up a bit because you don't want to start playing fast right away because um, it'll hurt if you try to strain. But um, also it helps for tapping type rips too. Sorry. Um, <laughs> so you, you got to use legato for tapping. So. So it also helps warming up for tapping. And also, if you want to work on your tapping fingers, if you do anything ridiculous, you can use. If you do working on any um, multi finger right hand tapping, pretty much just do hand runs with that. Pretty much, if you can do multi finger tapping, you should know how to warm up for tapping, anyways. So. Um, yeah, so just practice scales, and after you do that, if you want to... Yeah, I suck at pull-offs, but I'm working on it. It's getting better so far, so uh, thanks for watching. Peace.